Hey everybody, welcome back to Boomerangs by Vic. Got a new item that I'm uh, reviewing today and it is a Tesla coil, um, as you can see here. Pretty cool little device. Um, there's lots of different things that it can do. We'll start off with the basics as your power button. And that is on, let's turn this over to here. So the unit actually is a very bright, bright spark and it is quite noisy. You can turn the power up here, or you can change the frequency here. So that's if I turn the power up. And then if I turn the frequency up, it gets faster. And then if I click this switch over to here, it will work on a music app. And I will show you that in, a, in just a few minutes. So what we're gonna do right now is, there's a silver pin as you can see here on the top. And if you put different items on there, it will react to the item. It'll either spark off or it might actually burn it up. So we're gonna go find some cool items to put on here, like maybe some flowers uh, that I have outside. And then we'll come back in and we'll give it a bunch of different tests and uh, you'll see some really cool experiments here. Okay, everybody, let's get it going. Okay, so here you can see I got plenty of flowers out here. We're gonna try one of these here. Um, I'll have my daughter cut it off. This one here. And let's do this one. And how about a clematis? Let's do hmm, this one here. Okay, so we'll see if we can find some others. Yeah, so we'll take this little plant too. Yeah. All right, and we'll do this little rose. Okay, and we have some raspberries. Let's see what that raspberry does. Okay, so let's try this flower first. Now it's the first time I've ever done this. I've only seen people do this in videos, so I'm really unsure what's gonna happen. And we were about to find out. So what I'll do is I'll turn the power and the frequency up to get things going here. Oh, okay, so we got a little bit that's coming out the top. As you can see, it will fall on my finger. Let me uh, angle my camera up just a little higher. There we go. Okay, now let's turn the power up first. All right, that's pretty neat. Okay, that's full power. Now we're gonna turn up the frequency. All right, that's pretty cool. Oh, wow. All right. Yeah, it totally fried the flour. And because it's touching here, it ground it out. So let's uh, let's shut it off because she's smoking. <laughs> All right, let's try something else. Oops, let's make sure I'm recording. Yep. Okay, so this flower's quite a bit bigger. I don't even know if this one's gonna do anything to tell you the truth, but we shall see. We shall see. All right, here we go. Yeah, I don't, I think it's too big. It's too big, I got everything full blast. And it's not, oh, okay, if you look right here, you'll see. It's trying to ground to me. And believe it or not, that is actually, it's pretty warm. That's pretty warm to my finger. So yeah, I guess you can get items that are too big for it. So let's, uh, let's just switch out to something smaller. Okay, let's try this here. So that last one was a lily. I, I think day lily, some type of it a lily. This is a clematis flower. 
This one should be really cool. Oh, I can get it on the spam. There we go. Hopefully I have it on there enough. All right, let's click on the, ooh, let's turn these down first. You all wanna start with your settings at lowest point. And I would not suggest for anybody to do any of this stuff at home, okay? Oh, that's pretty cool. It's actually sparking on all edges. Okay, that's actually really neat. Whoa! <laughs> Just shut it off. Okay, hold on. I want to put that back on and try again. Okay, I have it on there again. Let's give it another try. Let's turn the frequency up first. Now the power. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Let's try something else. All right, this should actually be pretty cool. I'm gonna turn off my ceiling light. So this may show up better. Okay. Yeah, it should show up much better. Here we go. All right, so we're only getting a spark down here for some reason. Hmm. Okay, let me reattach it. All right, let's try the little shrub tree. All right, you see a little bit over here. Oh. Oh, that's full power. Crank the frequency. Yeah, it basically fried the branches right off. Still glowing. <laughs> okay, we have the little rose on there now, but I think it might be a little too thick, so I'm really not sure. Oh, guess I'm wrong. That's pretty good, that's a pretty good. totally fried it cooked it cooks the underneath of the leaf okay let's uh try something else all right let's try the little raspberry just gonna set it on there all right let's see if we can make some raspberry jelly <laughs> that's just funny Okay, let's turn her up and see what happens. Alrighty. Okay, so what we have here is just a regular Q-tip. And what I'll do after is, if this even works is all fray it up a little bit on the top and maybe it'll spark out more but we'll try it just alone and see what happens oh that's oh not what i expected that's different thought it was going to come out the top okay let's try something else okay i get the q-tip back in i frayed it a little to see what'll happen everything's on the lowest setting i'm going to turn the frequency all the way up before i turn it on and let's see what happens. Wow, that was quick. Yeah, this is why I say don't try any of this at home. 
just uh, watch me do this foolish stuff from my home. Much safer for you. Okay, this is a different type of Q-tip. I've cut in half and frayed out. It's, a, it's the plastic center. The last one was cardboard, so it was having a hard time staying on there. This is plastic, so let's see what happens. I'm turning the frequency all the way down this time, and we'll just see what happens. Wow, it's pretty quick. So anything with cotton, it just ignites it. Okay, for this last test, we're going to test some different types of bulbs. So these bulbs actually come with this unit when you buy it. Um, and does some pretty cool things. So let's turn it on. And I'm not even going to take these out of the bag. I'm just going to leave them in here. And as you can see, it actually lights the bulbs up. Right through the bag. It's pretty cool. Okay. Okay, for the last test, we're going to try out some different light bulbs. I'm going to put everything on the lowest setting. I've got on a rubber glove with cotton. And we'll see what will and what won't light up. So that one works. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neat, I gotta say. Now this is with the frequency and the power all the way down. Okay, this is a pretty small bulb. Ooh. Oh, I just dropped that one. Let's try this one here. Probably work better without this on there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, and I have here a very small crow feather. Let's see what happens. Let's slide it on a little bit more. I think it needs to be on at least till it's to where the little feather burrs are. Yeah, that's quite a ways on. That should make a difference. All right, let's turn it back on. All right, that's better. Okay, let's turn the power up. Yeah. Sorry, little feather. Fried ya. Yeah, so that's about it, everybody, for this unit. Um, if you're looking to get one of these for yourself, you want to mess around at home, uh, the information's down in the description to purchase this. And I do have, I do plan on doing a follow-up video because I do want to show you how the music app works uh, with this unit. And I want everybody to go down in the comments and give me some ideas for what you want me to try to put in my second video. Um, so we'll pretty much end it there. We'll turn it back on. Give you one last demonstration with the power all the way up. And the frequency all the way up. It's a pretty crazy unit. <laughs> Enjoy everybody, see ya. Don't forget to uh, subscribe, like the video, peace out.